good morning and welcome to today's upload my name's emma make sure you stick around for hauls and vlogs and all sorts of funny things i've got a strange shadow on my face which is giving me a little bit of a tan i am currently in hale zone which is um in birmingham and i am going to pop to b and m i've got my mask got my hand sanitizer and i will try and show you some of the bits and pieces that are in there and then when i get home i'll do a little a little haul i think it's very warm in um birmingham today and reasonably warm since it's supposed to be autumn but um, i'm going to try and get some hot chocolate stuff and then look at the halloween stuff um i'm also going to get some chocolate and stuff because i've been making the kids rice crispy cakes to put in their packed lunches which they've been loving so i'm gonna have a look at all of the things i just need to work out how i pay for parking because i don't know if um in england we don't we're not we use much cash at the moment so i shall have to try and investigate that so i will see you in a bit i've come to the cleaning bit because i'm going to pick up lots of cleaning products for my next adventure which i will tell you when i get home so i'm going to get some dusters i've never had a minky so i'm going to get a minky i'm going to get one of those um what else shall i get um some i'm going to get some minky sponges as well and all oh, this, I think this will be good for cleaning. That'll be good for giving stuff a good scrub. I'm not going to get any of these, but these are cute, aren't they? It says tidy, um, windows cleaning. But they really like, if you like Mrs. Hinch, these look really nice in your house or under your um, sink. They're cute. I they have got some adorable little um, dog jumpers or pet jumpers. Halloween ones, how cute are they? Oh, I'm going to see if I can find one um, in medium for Lisa. They've also got some cute little dog toys as well. I might pick those up for Lisa as well. A little treat for her. They've got some really lovely storage in. It's similar to the stuff at Donnell Mail. They've got blush pink, they've got grey, they've got white, all different sizes. Some clear ones. So I think I'm going to pick up a couple of these as well. Um, and then maybe come back another day when I work out exactly what I need and where. These shelves are lovely. Um, they look so nice. Uh, I will definitely be coming back to buy some of these, I think. Oh, I wonder what a three-tier shelf looks like. How cute is this for nine pound, a three-tier shelf? Gold metal frame with wooden shelves. I think this will look really nice, maybe in Erin's room. So she can put some of her little knickknacks on there or just lovely. Christmas stuff is starting to creep in. And these would be really nice for autumn. Look at that, it's lovely. And stag. I used to love stags. I've also got other loads of little pretty knickknacks. These would be nice in like bedrooms. Oh, what's that? I don't know what it is. This is a leaf. It looks like a fin. Oh my gosh, we knew. That if I saw a Gnome, oh, I love that one. I don't need any more Gnomes though, do I? Let me know in the comments if you need more gnomes. They've got loads of like their Christmas stuff out. Oh, we come towards some Halloween stuff in a bit as well. Look, they're so cute. Um, oh, I'm getting very excited for Christmas. Let me know if you lot are. I'll definitely be doing some Christmas little come shop with me and stuff. <gasps> cute they haven't got a huge amount of halloween stuff here actually <gasps> oh that is creepy so not much not much halloween bits and pieces um i have picked up one of these because obviously i love all good focus um but yeah not much oh they're fun they're cool in our old house um well in the house we're at the moment we've got lots of shutters and in the new house we need lots of curtains um, I'm not going to pick any today because I don't know the sizes, but they've got some really nice, like if we do Ethan's Harry Pottery room again, they'd be good. Or they'd be good. Or just blackout ones, but these are great. Back in the car, I just met a lovely follower, for, that was you. Hello, your daughter's called Meadow, what a lovely name. Um, Halloween, there was no, there was hardly any Halloween stuff, so... 
um yeah that was disappointing so i'm gonna go back now and do a little uh haul for you i think there's probably no halloween stuff maybe because there's not gonna be much halloween this year perhaps that's what shops are thinking and i doubt they'll be trick-or-treating and stuff so i don't know but yeah let's go back home i'm gonna chat about my exciting news more and uh let's go through the bits and pieces that i picked up for the new house okay i'm back home now put a little bit of lipstick on to feel fancy for you and i've just was replying to some of your comments from my video uh that i went up today uh the h m haul so hello um hello to the 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 young lady i think or lady who commented about um when autumn starts and stuff because i just love comments like that i know you said it was random and i am random and i liked it so thank you very much right yes as i said in the car bit disappointing but i think i'm guessing that maybe as we're not gonna be trick-or-treating and stuff perhaps that's why there's not so much halloween stuff i'm not sure but yes on to the big news i am moving house dun 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 and i'm gonna do a video on wednesday like a vloggy homey vlog all about um the move uh, a bit more information a bit more details and we're very excited what i will say is that um we did sell our house a few months ago like in lockdown we loved doing rooms that we did erin's room we did ethan's room um we did the bathroom and we really loved it and then we just got like this bug and we were like oh maybe we need a bit more of a challenge uh so we sold the house and then because Stephen and I are both self-employed, it was quite difficult and because of a COVID to get a mortgage, it was really hard. Um, but as I said, I will talk all about that on Wednesday and you know what that means? Moving vlogs! <laughs> moving vlogs! There'll be moving vlogs, there'll be home hauls. The new house we're moving to um, needs a bit of work doing to it. Uh, not, not vast amounts, but there will be interiorsy kind of bits and pieces going on so oh. so my plan is for today what i'm going to start doing the next couple of weeks is getting bits ready so i'm going to have a box and i'll talk more about this when we're vlogging um like that we need as soon as we get there that we can just like dip into and get get all our bits and pieces so anyway before we move on to those bits let's move on to the non-housey bits the bits that i got just for fun. So for two pounds, I got a further little dog. I got a pumpkin, a spider, a Frankenstein, and a little mummy, and I will put these aside and I'll give these to the kids and they can give it to the dog. I also got her a pumpkin, little jumper for four pound. So cute. She she doesn't mind wearing which we don't often put her in clothes really, but if we do, she doesn't she quite likes being all snuggled, so that's quite cute. Um I will say that Lucy is definitely slowing down i took her for a lovely walk yesterday um and she was exhausted when she got back so we're kind of doing like little little, little walks now uh, i also got this hocus pocus because you know i'm a big disney fan and i thought that would look really nice in the new living room uh erin and ethan have packed lunches and i've started making them like little rice crispy cakes i know these aren't the most exciting things to cook but it makes them so happy so i got some dairy milk and ethan also who we're gonna have beavers face to face but in if you're in other countries uh in england we now have a rule of six where you can only meet six people so you can only have six people in your house or six people in your garden however where i live in birmingham we're not even allowed to do that so we can meet people in a park we can go for a meal for, with people the kids can go to school but we're not allowed to have anybody in our house so long story short the beavers which was going to be face to face is now back on zoom and they're doing lots of cooking and they have to do something with bananas this week and chocolate so i've got lots of chocolate i also picked up a couple of bags of marshmallows for hot chocolate and also i put these in the rice crispy cake um erin said to me yesterday she said mummy the consistency of your rice crispy cake today was just perfect and i was like why should we? it was just the right amount of crunchy and i was like oh so it was so cute 
Anyway, let's move on to the homey bits that I've gotten um, that I'm gonna put in my little box. So when we get to the house, we're ready to kind of go. I've bought, the new house has got a couple of bathrooms. So I've bought um, two new toilet brush holders. One white, one gray. Bet you thrilled with that purchase. More exciting purchases. I have got a new dustpan and brush because the one we have currently got is all cracked and smashed. I got two, I'm just gonna move it down here, two of these little organization boxes, which is where I'm gonna put all my cleaning bits and bobs and then it's ready so we can get in and give the house a good clean. Because when you move house, that's the first thing I'm like obsessed with, getting everything like scrubbed. So I thought that this would be good for that. Um, green sponges. Oh, it reminds me of my nan, my lovely nanny Joyce, who isn't, as you know, is no longer with us used to just buy me green sponges all the time and it's not something I often buy but I've got them today now and also not this house but the house before um my nan came around and she must have been 80 I don't know 84 or something and she got on her hands and knees and she was scrubbing and she was getting things out the drain. So she's a superstar. These actually weren't from B&M. These were from Asda and I have never used a command strip in my life. But as we know, I like lots of pictures and I think these might be game changing. Could you let me know? Are they good? Is it, is this a good thing? So I, I will keep you posted, but I got, um, 5.4 kilograms which is for like heavy pictures then a 1.81 one, and then i got some of these because um i'm gonna put some fairy lights up in a little part of um erin's room so i thought hey try them rather than putting loads of nails in and making stephen cross <laughs> i always pick up a couple uh, you know some of these if i go to poundland or anywhere like that or b&m or home bargains so i've got fresh lid in inter interior dehumidifier I don't know what the place is gonna be like when we get there, so this might be good for little storage cupboards or little nooks and crannies that need a bit of air taken out, a little bit of, um, what's the word? Liquid taken out of the air, steam, moist. I don't know, you know what I'm talking about. I also picked up for a pound some yellow dusters. Yellow dusters? hard to come by why is this people let me know do people not use dusters to dust what do people use to dust now i don't know but i've got some look luxury dusters as well i've got a little gas lighter set because you know i like my candles and we're kind of running out uh you can refill them these are refillable ones as well uh, so i've got those for the new the new house um, I've never had a minky, ever. Never had a minky. And I know Mrs. Hinch is all about the minky, so I got myself a little one of them. And I'll use it to clean stuff. Antibacterial kitchen cleaning pad. I mean, that can't be bad, can it? I'll be scrubbing with that. I also got some little hooks because I have seen that when some people, when people have little cupboards they open, they have things there and they can like hang like bits and pieces like oven goods, I don't know, but I got them, two pounds. So they'll come in use somewhere, I'm not sure where. I also got a couple of minky sponge wipes. Stephen likes these ones, this is a, his choice, cleaning choice product. And I just got a, one pack of extra large wipes just for those super, super, super grubby manky bits because that's what houses are like. And I got, I'm gonna hold it up, it has made such a mess everywhere of my car. I've got like a little tiny, just a really little doormat that I thought we could just put in because, you know, there'll be removal men coming in and out and I just thought, I liked it, it was pretty and it was three pound. So there we go, oh I've just spotted, I also got the kids some Halloween sprinkles. <gasps> maybe I could put some, sp oh my gosh, maybe I could do like themed Rice Krispie Cakes and put a few little ghost sprinkles in. Oh that'll blow her in mind, she'll explode. So there we go, yes, big news. Um, 
can't wait to bring you along for the ride it's gonna be interesting it's gonna be exciting uh yeah can't wait big big news and we just didn't tell anybody because and you know look i've put all my pumpkins out i thought we weren't moving my whole house is full of, of pumpkin stuff because i thought oh we, i thought oh, i just thought do you know what if we don't get the mortgage we can just kind of stay here carry on so i got all the pumpkins out and then we found out that it was all going through so me lucky pumpkins <laughs> i'm gonna have to try so Stephen was like oh my gosh he's like well you can just transport them and get them out of the new house we'll just have a bag allocated to the pumpkins i was like okay so i love you lots guys and i will see you in a couple of days for like a real ho nice homely chatty vlog talking about the house showing you some bits and pieces that we're tidying up and packing maybe talking about some style ideas i want for the new house and i will see you for another upload soon chat to me in the comments